All right. Um, first thing I'm going to do. Let's put. Let's put. You back on. All right. I'm going to change the does the dog die link while I remember. I'm also going to change the game. Let's go to does the dog die. The dog die. Let's also go to Nightbot. The Devil May Cry 5. Video game 2019. That's. Yep, that's it. Let's log in. Commands, custom. Got a timers as well. Kind of bot that will do basically what you do with Nightbot. If you want to look at it for the content warnings. What does it actually do? Right, because that's... Um, Devil May Cried. So that should be... I don't know if you do... Is it CW or TW? I can't remember. Yep, that now takes you to the new one. Let's change the game. Devil May Cry. Five. Done. Hopefully that will change the game in um, which and I'm going to try something that might be a bit. A, yeah. I'm going to try something that might be a bit silly. I'm going to... Hey, pop time. It pops up the content one and with the does the dog I think based on what you list as your game on Twitch. Oh, okay, so it literally just automates what I've just done. Fair enough. Um, I'm going to try the mouse and keyboard controls on Devil May Cry 5, which might be a bad move given I mean I've played four games with the same it's the same um you know the word controller controls controller controls that seems arbitrary um yeah I've I've you know what I've not done On window capture, it is not capturing the window. <laughs> You're gonna let me send your whisper to it. Uh, put it in the Discord. That's the easiest way of getting me to see things. Right, let's remove the game capture and try again. Window capture. Let's call it DMC5, optimistically. Awesome. It turns out it was just Devil May Cry, not Devil May Cry 5 theme. Is that the bot? Wally. No, that that's um that bot was from a game called what was it called? Phoning Home. It's very Wally like. Um yeah, very cute robot. Really? Low blood sugar? Really? Ow! 
How is my blood sugar low? I've eaten a fucking packet of Jaffa cakes and... No, no, no. I'll see how it goes. We're ending in 20 minutes anyway, so we'll see how it is by then. But yeah, I'm going to try the uh, trying to eat cookies. I will have some more Jaffa cakes in 20 minutes if that's what I need. Because uh. sometimes it just goes up by itself, which is... I missed this cutscene when I was testing. Same crap, different day. So, tell me. Tell you what? How does it feel to be rescuing the guy that killed your father? Hey, I'm glad we're getting personal. Well, he abandoned my mother and I and left us for dead. I feel nothing. Well, he's not exactly going up for Father of the Year Award now, is he? His research wasn't half bad. Came in handy. I'll be thankful for that. If they have to do that in here, it already smells like ass. That's you! <laughs> hey, Nico? Don't lose your tits. I see you. I would not put a vinyl record player in a vehicle. Like hey, you have to hit every single bump in the road. <laughs> Gonna ruin my crew. Literally, yes. Which is why I wouldn't put a record player in a vehicle. It would just skip all over the place. I had a I had a record player when I was like a teenager in my room. And it had to go on a shelf. Because I put it on a cabinet that was sitting on the floor and me walking across the room would cause it to skip because of the floorboards moving. They were not stable. It would be awful. There's a reason why no one... I mean, there's several reasons why no one did that. For all its faults, the cassette was a brilliant invention for mobile music. Better than CD, actually. Sound quality was shit in comparison, but it didn't skip. It's basically it, it didn't skip. Oh, this is kind of cool. But also, I I had a Walkman. I had a um, I had a. It's probably not technically a Walkman. I don't think it was Sony. But I had a mobile cassette player, and it was actually you know you need big pockets to fit it, but it would fit in. I had a JVC CD player that was awesome, by the way, because it could play MP3s. They could fit like a hundred tracks on a on a CD. It was great. But you couldn't actually take it out. It wouldn't actually fit in a pocket and it would skip if you, you know, jumped or something. Then I still have literally here, literally here. Oh, look, it's a iPod classic. It's still one of the best media devices I've got and ever had 120 gig iPod classic pretty solid the modern players aren't that bad to be fair though I 
now have a phone that has 128 gigs internal storage and a terabyte SD card. So I'm kind of... It's kind of replaced the iPod Classic a little bit. Pretty sorry, modern record players aren't that bad. And to be to be fair, it wasn't the quality of the record players. The fact that my floorboards were so fucking janky. Right, so, you know, same old preamble, um, new game, new um, settings I've not really played with. Let's change that. Um, sound. Large. <laughs> large dynamic range. Um, because I don't know if the brightness is. But... I mean, that's barely visible for me. I don't know what it's like for you. I'm, yes, I'm an inverter person. I have Star Wing or Star Fox for the Super Nintendo to thank for that. Language, I don't know why I'm changing this. I want. I'd probably want English. Um, graphics. We're off, yes. Effect quality, high. Ambient occlusion type. How much do I want to tank the frame rate? How much do I want to tank the tank the frame rate with ambient occlusion? To be fair, I'm getting over a hundred at the moment, which is chromatic aberration off. Thank fuck. Can't do it unless it's an airplane flying game. I can see that, but I just got used to it. Um. All right, we're um, we're gonna see how it goes. Gonna, I mean, I, I know it's hardly the most challenging you can see. I'm mean, getting like 118 FPS at the moment, so hopefully it's fine. If the frame rate drops because of OBS, um, do tell me and I'll change some things. Sixty-two, seventy. Okay, that mm, okay. Dante. Very good so far. Awesome. To be honest, listen, I can, I usually judge how 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 things are going by how loud the fan is. And it's not actually that loud. So Yeah. It seems to be doing alright. PC gamer. I mean, it's a true Linux PC gamer because on Windows I'd have an overlay that had all of my stats. I would not, wouldn't even, I got, well, I really did it for, if fan isn't loud, PC isn't working that. Yeah, exactly. But I would, I would originally have that for like diagnostics, but it got to the point where I just got used to just always having MSI Afterburner up there. But, um... Press and hold shift. Okay, that's the lock on. Press shift and control. I guess not, okay, that's not that... I guess that's not janky, that janky. I can press it with my left, uh... You know what, this, this game is actually really pretty so far. I thought the MC4 looked quite good. Um, I know... I know the MC4 is like a 
PS3, Xbox 360 era game, but I thought he looked really nice, but actually this game is really pretty. <laughs> That's the thing though. I think PS3 era games were sort of Airborne Evil, Green Empusa, Epusa? Whatever that said. Um, press. All right. Shift and left stick back on the mouse. Okay, Q and... Demons helping each other out? What's the world coming to? What the fuck does that mean? Shit. Right. No? Um, is it like... I don't know what back on the mouse means. Like, I'm moving it back and clicking. As if I was doing the left sh left stick and whatever, but green orb, the magical means uh, green zone of crystallized demon fluid. Pick one to cover a set amount of vitality. Okay. I presume the game's going to tell us what happened to his demon hand. Mm, see you then. Yeah, but there's a thing about the PS3, Xbox 360 era art style. It was really... It was kind of done dirty by the hardware, actually. Like, it used to run badly at inconsistent frame rates. It would be blurry. Like I saw Skyrim running on a PS3, that did not do that game justice at all. Oh, that's weird. My 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 scroll to <laughs> go left and right. That's less than ideal. But actually, if you take those games, you run them at 4K, and you you know high refresh is they're actually really easy to run i'm not a fan of ps3 for high graphic games the hardware no but you take games from that era and you play them now on a modern graphics card at high resolution high frame rate they look gorgeous actually the reason they look shit on a ps3 because you're playing them at probably 540p at 15 16 frames a second and I don't, I don't just mean the PS3, I mean the Xbox as well. I'm just using PS3 as a shorthand. It was the genera- Oh, you're a pentacle boy. But actually, because there was- You know, they ran on a Wii U and a Switch. They're actually pretty easy to run at really high settings these days. On like mid-tier hardware, so... They kind of- they kind of aged decently. You know, that gen was trash. But it wasn't... Oh, hello, lady. And Trish. And Dante. It wasn't the hardware, I think, necessarily. Well, looks like this won't be a total waste of time after all. I think the worst hey, thing that happened... Did your mother ever teach you it's not nice to steal? I need to turn the subtitles on. A lot of PS3 games PS4 Pro and it's so much better. Yeah, I'll... After the cutscene, I'll continue my rant. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to... Go to options and I'm gonna... See if there's a subtitle... Yes, there is. On. Alright, my rant. 
the PS3 and Xbox 360 plugged into a CRT actually don't look that bad. I think the worst thing that happened at that point was the whole HD thing. Because the hardware just wasn't ready for it. And flat panels look shit if you what you plug in is not native resolution. There's a there's a digital foundry video actually. They they play control on a CRT. And it was good. Brilliant. Like a CRT complete with OLED. In some ways, CRT is better. It's by definition high ref I need to change my camera so my finger is not always off the screen. That's awesome. <laughs> That'll do. Right. So by definition, a shit CRT is shit. I've never had a shit CRT though. Like I've never really Like my 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 I guess because I because I grew up in the nineties and two thousands, my later end of the CRT era I've always had good CRTs like I find it weird when people talk about scan lines because I've never seen a CRT with scan lines they've never been visible like that's not a thing that I have experienced like but by definition CRT is always natively about 240 hertz because it has to be otherwise you get flicker like if you literally, literally the, the 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 ray gun, I was gonna call it. Oh, what do I mean? I'm 31. Am I 31? G yes, I'm 31. <laughs> I had to think about that. Um, but because because the the ray gun, I'm gonna keep calling it a ray gun, is firing electrons at a piece of phosphorus one pixel at a time, like horizontally, then down to the next line, then down to the next line. If it weren't fast enough, you wouldn't see an image. They are fascinating to look look at with a high high speed camera. You know, I've never seen scan lines. Shit. Yeah. I mean, maybe I was just too far away from them. What the fuck is this? Thirty-five as of two days ago. Oh, happy birthday two days ago. I mean, we're following in the tradition of what the fuck do I do here? What was... What scan lines are every CRT I've owned? I mean... Maybe I was just too far away from them. That's possible. Alright, Iago, calm your tits. Look who's woke up. Was I supposed to die there? Get the feeling I was supposed to lose that fight.
This is very dramatic. Could introduce himself. I think this is bad. You should see the last city I saved. Where's Dante? He's buying time, but it doesn't look good. One tentacly boy. Not just Dante. Dante, Nero, Trish, and Lady lost. Considering they all refused to help each other in the in the last game. Details. I see. All right. Um. I'm gonna go to the main menu then, because it's midnight, and that was a really good time to. That was really good timing, actually. All right, let's um, exit out. And... Oop, that's the wrong button. Right. I'm kind of excited to play more of that because that's... That was fun. I mean, the other games were fun. As well, the best of about two, the better. But <laughs> the rest of the games were fun. Let's see you streaming in the meantime. Let's... Uh... Let's see... Um, it's midnight. Yep. Yeah, yeah, it's midnight. Which means it's technically Monday morning, which means I need to get ready for work tomorrow. Um, so having me, um, yeah. Oh, I, oh, I think it's still streaming. Close on a bike. How long has she been awake? 21 hours nearly. Fucking hell. Right, okay. Let's go. Let's go see Tiffany is playing Undertale, which is a I mean it's Undertale. I don't really need to give a preamble, do I? Great. Tiffany. Which uh oh it looks like it looks like she's done the the um what's it called? The neutral route it is going over to do the uh good route, if that makes sense. Um all right, let's get our raid messages up. All right, copy and paste the raid message that you have the emotes for, and I'll hope you back in the near future. I'm trying to sort out <laughs> my life <laughs> to get to the point where I can actually stream and exercise and plan and all that stuff regularly without you know well regularly so yeah we'll see how that goes and yeah hopefully be back soon i don't i don't want to i don't want to stream weekly if that makes sense i want to stream more often but yeah it's a question of sorting out my schedule but yeah good night and i'll see you later